for days, weeks. I've been trying to get the 3080. Best Buy, out of stock. Amazon, out of stock. Newegg, out of stock. And finally, after days of camping out of Micro Center, I finally got my hands on the 3080. And now, I can get 30 FPS in Fortnite. What's up guys, it's Kamala here, and today we're going to be playing some Arena with my new RTX 3080 GPU. The GPU I have is the MSI Ventus 3X Overclock Edition, and obviously that's the GPU I have in my PC. And the CPU I have is the Ryzen 9 3900 XT, with 32GB of Corsair Vengeance RAM, and obviously a Zoom Funko Pop for extra speed. If you guys are new to this channel, don't forget to drop a like and drop a sub. Also to support me, use credit code Kamala and Item Shop. So without further ado, Let's get in the video. I'm gonna be showing you guys me building in creative on really low settings, and then I'm gonna be showing you guys me building in creative on really, really high settings. So I'll show you all my settings first. I have them all on low. So you got all of these, blah, blah, you know, the regular low settings. I have uh, reflex boost on on plus plus or whatever. Remember guys, I'm recording at like 40K bit rate, so you gotta minus that like off the frames also, and at 60 FPS. And like I get almost 500 looking in the sky, sometimes it hits 500. But that's really cool to me. I, like, I never get this many frames while recording. Fortnite is CPU bound, meaning you need a really good CPU to get, like, good frames too. Like, maybe, like, a Intel CPU because their single core is so good. And Fortnite's all single core performance. Anyways, without me being a nerd, here we go crank on some high FPS. So this is all epic settings without DLSS on and with ray tracing on. I put DLSS on performance, and look at that. My frame just went so high when I put DLSS on performance, it's crazy. I was trying to crank on this. Crank it on epic settings, never done before. Actually, it doesn't feel that bad, what? Guys, yeah, cranking on high epic settings does not feel that bad. New setting, question mark? <laughs> Something else, look at this, oh my god. That's actually really cool. Like you can see the reflection of the build through the black glass. That's actually really cool. All right, boys, it's finally time to hop into a real match. This is me capped at 240 FPS in a random game of a solo cash cup. And keep in mind that I only use one PC. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Feeling a bit of aim assist in my bones. Let's just put an F in a chat for this kid before this fight even starts.
easy win with the 3080. Now I'm gonna be trying to play solo arena on my frames with unlimited. I did notice though my frames were actually better capped at 240 while recording. I hope no one heard that. Yo, what's up, boys? Yes, and I know you guys hear it. My voice literally sounded robotic in this video. I don't know why my mic was acting up so bad. Just guess you guys have to listen to Robo Kamali. Talking my opponent. He doesn't know where I am. And he has no headphones. Yeah, you like that, huh? You like shooting people? Ha, uh, just chilling in my box, minding my business. Hold on. Did he just take the L on me? I hope he learns to never do that again in his life. I got what you like. oh. Although we got second, that wasn't a bad match at all. Getting 240 FPS and a pretty low input delay while recording is really good to me, especially at 40k bitrate. I noticed that playing on limited FPS while recording doesn't do me really good, so I'm probably gonna keep it capped for most of my videos. Thank you guys so much for watching, and if you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like and drop a sub. Also, to support me, use creator code Kamali in the item shop. It's Kamali, and I'm out.